Your hair looks great, Lexi. <laughs> Texas Radio, presented by David Gardner's Jewelers here in the Rollo Insurance Studio. Time for Around the Association. Scott Walker in the house. Hello, sir. Hey, man. Class of 90, VP in the house. Lexi Hudson, when's the last time you were here? I think I was pregnant last time I was here. I really, we were talking about that before we started. I really think it was like, we were talking about Aggie Park, and I was full-blown pregnant and well, but, ready to give birth. <laughs> but it was open or not open, Aggie Park? I think it was. It I was, don't think it was open yet. Mm-hmm. Holy, it's been that long? Yeah. It's been that long. Congratulations. Thank you. I think he's nine months and full of love. And I bet. I see all the updates. Chunkiest little baby I've oh. ever seen. <laughs> you, you guys look uh, very happy. we got some business to get into. We did. All right, first off, am I going to be seeing you on game days? I feel like that's our thing. We see that each other every couple thing. of weeks. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I hope so. Yeah. I hope so. And hopefully it's a much better season. Uh, yes, much, absolutely. Much better. Let's talk about the gathering. What's, what's going on? I know we have some pictures to show here. We do. So... Um, you said it's going to be a much better season, right? It's time yep. of optimism. It's it's the start of a new school year. Um, it is the the fish class coming in, and so um, we always start that year off with what we call the gathering, and it's we invite all the new fish to come in. I mean, everybody's invited, but it's mostly aimed at the freshmen. And they come over to our place, and we put some food in their bellies and let them try on Aggie rings with their class year on it, and. Um, bring some athletes to talk to them and they're they're all so energetic because for them it's not just the start of a new school year it's a new chapter in their lives yeah. right I mean this is their first day or the night before their first day of Texas A&M as a college student and it's just so energizing it's 110 degrees outside but they're just full of energy and full of life and uh, it's a great time it's one of my favorite events and it really sets up the year because that's like the that's the starting gun right yeah because now we got we got two semesters and then the summer, and uh, and it's just back to back to back. Uh, well, doesn't that kind of go into the the legend of the Aggie ring too? Because like my kids ask me, why why is our ring more important than? It? I was like, it just is. Like, <laughs> it, like you'll once you step on campus, like it's like trying on a Letterman jacket that the varsity guy has. That you, it's the same thing. Like now I'm really I'm in the club, but now I'm in the club. Right, absolutely. It's a it's a mark of distinction. It identifies you to your fellow Aggies, and not just your fellow Aggies. I mean, other people know what that ring means. I mean, we've been stopped yeah. anywhere, right? Like, hey, Absolutely. is that an Aggie ring? Like, yeah. and sometimes people say, is that a championship ring? I'm like, yeah, <laughs> championship <laughs> of <Absolutely>. scholar. <laughs> uh, Lexi, all Aggie hullabaloo coming up as well. Yes, we are super excited, not only for football season, but of course, all Aggie hullabaloo. It's every home game. We Everybody comes to the association. We have pregame, just fun. We've got vendors. Um, this year, we're hoping to add some food trucks, um, some free alcohol, thanks to Kristen Distributing, which they're a huge, huge support for us. Um, Kendra Scott, the Canva. We've got DJ Rob. And if you've never heard DJ Rob, DJ Rob can spin some tracks. Okay, I will tell you. Twos. He hypes up everything that he is at, so we're super excited to have him again this year. Do you know what that means, the ones and twos? I know that they use that lingo. Yes. You know what it means? No. I, don't know. I know Scott knows. <laughs> yeah. Someone is listening right now, typing the text line right Ones now. Ones and two. It's the first, uh, I think it's the first, I don't know, whatever. Go ahead. Continue on. I'm sorry for interrupting. No, you're fine. So the first one will be Saturday, September 2nd at 2.30. Um, it is absolutely free. That's one thing that we, we really push for is that this is a free event. We just want you to come hang out. We do ask that you register just so that you can get a wristband to get that free alcohol and yep. those free drinks in the water and whatnot because it will be hot. So you need to hydrate. Um, but if you want to register it's tx.ag backslash augie hola blue and we hope to see everybody there yeah i hope so too and tailgating gonna be cray cray this year sorry i'm getting all young um, on the show today but uh always a great time aggie park popping it is the the park is so spectacular it, and it, it has elevated everything in that part of campus and certainly tailgating not least among them um we've got a new space set aside for tailgate, an additional space set aside for tailgating this year, the Aggie Spirit Lawn. Um, we've got, it's a, it's a paid tailgating space. There are packages that start as low as a, as a few hundred dollars. Um, we're partnered with Revel XP on this. Um, it's just the best tailgating place on campus. I mean, it's right there by the lake. It's right there by Kyle Field. It's right there by the Alumni Center and the Creamery, the, the Moore Family Creamery. Uh, spectacular views, all the action. Um, it's a, it's going to be a, a good deal. Well, you know, one of the things about Aggie Park I'm looking forward to is the, I, I do that weekly hit with KBTX. They're going to be doing their pregame show from Aggie Park, too. So. Yes, right. yes. Be, yes. Be, They'll be, be right there, right in the action. Yep. Um, anything else? I, you, you mentioned the Aggie Spirit Lawn. Um, can people, like, is this something you want to sign up weeks in advance? Can you do it the week of? 
Uh, certainly, it's first come, first, first served, yeah. and you have a better uh, selection the earlier sure. you register. But um, there's 160 spaces. Is that right? I think 160, maybe a little bit more. But it's, I mean, it's 60,000 square feet. Square feet. Yeah. There's room. Of, oh yeah, there's plenty. There's, there's room. room. Yeah. room. Tx.ag/slash Aggie Spirit Lawn, and uh, that you can. There's those entry level packages, but you can also add on food and drinks and TVs and all the extra stuff Wi-Fi, if you want. Huh? All the things. Yeah. Technology's ridiculous. Like, <laughs> we'll get into that some other time. Sponsorship times, right? Yes. Uh, vendor opportunities with the association. Yes. So there are a ton of opportunities that we have, not only for event sponsorships, but partnerships as well. And of course, advertising in Texas Aggie Magazine and Aggie News. We're gearing up for 2024, which I can't believe I'm already saying that, that we're selling those spots pretty quick. Um, but that's one thing that I... I love that we do is we include those local vendors and those local businesses and even Aggie owned and operated um, other businesses, just welcoming them then with sponsorships. So gathering, we had a uh, visit call station, destination, Brian, um, Brookshire's, Brookshire Brothers, CC Creations, just to name a few. And of course at the other events, like all Aggie Hola Blue and then the Aggie Ring Day Marketplace was one that we are super excited. We started last year. Um, all the events offer wide variety of options. So presenting sponsor titles um, to just coming and having a booth there and interacting with these uh, the guests and the friends and family of Texas A&M. Um, lots of opportunities. And if you are interested um, to check out the partner program packet, uh, tx.ag backslash partner program, um, or you can email us sponsorships at aggienetwork.com for more information. So one of the things that Randy emailed me copy, I don't know, six weeks ago, two months ago about um, employment opportunities with the association. And the thing that speaks to me about it is I get asked all the time, like, I, I would love to move back to Aggie Land. I'd love to, but I got to find, you guys are hiring in many different areas. Absolutely. Um, Texas A&M is growing. We're growing. Um, always trying to do more and find opportunities to have a greater impact on Texas A&M, Texas Aggies. We've got entry level positions open and then we've got mid career stuff open and director level positions open. Um, IT, accounting, programming, um, fundraising, communications. Um, it's a great place to work. You're right there on campus. You're in the middle of the action. You get to work all the events that we come on here and talk about, like Aggie Ring Day and Gathering and all Aggie Hola Blue. Um, get to partner up with people like Tex Ags, right? Yeah. Um, it's, it's a wonderful town to live in, and it's a, it's a great place to live, great place to raise kids. Um, and so, yeah, if somebody's looking to come back to Aggieland and start a new chapter of their life, the Association of Former Students is a fantastic opportunity. Interestingly, I, I've noticed that it's not just retirement age folks no. that are moving. And like, we're getting everybody, like 30s, 20s, you know, people aren't leaving. Hello, like there's, <laughs> there's, we have it in this office quite a bit. So it's a lot of great opportunities. Absolutely. Absolutely. I did roughly two decades in my prior career. Marie and I came back in 2007. And that was one of the best things we ever did. How long were you gone? I was gone for about four years. Okay. I think, yeah, four years. Couldn't wait to get back. I couldn't wait to get back. Once I once I applied and and you know accepted the position, I was eager and ready. Yeah. Eager and ready. And I never thought I would be, but I'm. I would not trade it for the world. Lexi and Scott, thank you very much for coming in. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate thank you. Too. All right, we'll come back with more. It's Tex Ags Radio, presented by David Gardner's Jewelers.